Big Brother has an additional mission for you. Okay. On Sunday morning, you are to address the house and announce your bottom six housemates. That is, the six housemates who least impressed you this week. Yeah, guys, before you continue with the remaining part of the video, today Biggie gave Maria an extra tax, and this one, it was really tough for her. Okay. You must tell them to pack your bags and deliver them into the storeroom okay. as they await your final verdict. <laughs> okay, sure. And she asked some questions that even Biggie ignored. Yes, because during that uh, diary section, she asked Biggie if there will be real eviction because of what Biggie told her to do. So guys, before I continue, you are welcome to my channel and do not forget to hit the red subscribe button below and turn on your notification bell and comment your opinion on what you feel about this video. And would you like to discuss anything else with Big Brother? Um, so there's definitely no eviction on Sunday, correct? Do you have anything else to discuss with Big Brother? So guys, as I was saying, Biggie gave Maria a strong task that really made her ask a question that Biggie refused to answer. Okay, what was the task? Biggie told Maria that she should um, call the housemates on Sunday, sit them down and call out six persons that she feels did not really impress her very well. Okay, this got Maria really um, kind of scared and she wasn't with herself. If you look at her during the diary section, you just know that she wasn't so happy about that. So she went ahead and asked Biggie if there would be any real eviction, which Biggie asked her if she had any other question that her diary section is over. It means that Biggie dodged that question. But I'm still coming to, um, let me just say, I feel what I feel that Biggie is planning to do. I'll tell you guys that later. So now during uh, the diary session for, during the other housemates diary session, like um, White Money, during White Money's diary section, he actually um, told the Biggie, uh, asked Biggie here, yeah, he asked Biggie how he looked how he look and uh biggie told him to ask para that question that's he should ask his former head of house that question that's really very funny he even laughed and <laughs> it's really a funny question so biggie also asked the housemates how um they are going to use their money because um liquor rose has up to 1.8 m and um liquor rose says she's going to open shops for the mother and for the elder brother and she's also going to get a studio dance studio that she says she's going to rent it that's what she's going to do with her uh, 1.8 m so angel said that she is going to open a um let's say an organization for, that we help women that though she's going to need sponsors but that is what she's going to start with and she's going to have a, a salon and a spa of course she needs to look kinky was what she said and uh, um we also have some of the housemates that still told biggie what they feel and how they feel they're going to use their money because biggie was asking them that during the diary section so guys i'm still going to give us let's say a little flashback to the names of housemates that um maria wrote down that really impressed her and the way she scored these housemates i'm telling you she scored them <laughs> i just I, don't worry when i call it you're going to hear it by yourself so i am actually going to uh, list all of them for you and tell you some of the things that even happened before that um names that she listed and the let's say the lowest housemate but guys let me do a little flashback see guys i'm going to tell you the list uh of housemate and this cause that uh, maria actually gave this housemate but before i continue i am going to tell you the main reason my i feel 
Maria has called this housemates. Yes. Now look at this. Biggie told Maria to write down or let's say to make sure that the housemaid impresses her. So, and uh, she is the only one that knows there's no eviction. She's the only one that knows there's no nomination. She is actually the only person that knows everything secretly with Biggie. And uh, now, you are actually writing down the names of people that impress you. <laughs> and you're giving them percentage. I just, I'm, as I told you, I'm going to list the names and the way she actually wrote the um score. So, now you are actually expecting the housemaid i mean adults to kind of uh i don't even know how they how she want people to impress her but all i know is this is biggest house you going to score them is kind of funny because these housemates can never ever do beyond themselves that is normal adult for you because i am i noticed that so many of them have very low mark yes that is one thing that is really funny about this whole thing so many they have, have have very low mark especially if at the people that she's not really relating with and so most of these people that she's relating with have high marks i mean what kind of sense is that you're obviously making us to understand that what we feel about you maria is the truth but i don't want to say more that let me just quickly tell loss i'll list down the names of the housemates that actually scored high let me just say it that way so we have saga she scored saga 65 percent we have emmanuel she scored emmanuel 55 percent we have a piece she scored peace of course that's the friend 60 percent we have nini 60 all those are friends you obviously know these are friends liquor 60 percent oh that is friendship goes man so we have you know, Jepo, Jepo has 65%. We have Boma, the almighty deputy to Maria. We have, uh, he, he has 70%. Of course, she wants us to believe that Boma has been pressing her everywhere. Though Boma has been acting to impress everyone in that house because that's why he calls himself Okro. But that doesn't give you a strong fan base if I'm to uh, advise Boma. I just feel you should just be yourself. But if yourself is snitching and trying to impress everyone like look at what uh boma did the other day when uh, angel and jim jmk were discussing they were like um they are going to take down some ships um jmk said i have my eye on emmanuel i don't think someone actually told jmk that this was the same discussion that caused serious big in the house when the beatrice was around ah someone would have told her at least uh, especially angel but boma was there when they were discussing that that is the different now you know the other time they discussed it, it was just um angel and beatrice so now angel and jmk discussed this and boma was there that was at the um the um basket sorry what am i saying at the game sport so now now we have a you saw 40 percent that's very funny we have crossed 50 percent we have some of the housemates we are actually scoring 40 percent only uh some 55 but mostly scored 40 percent this if you watch these are like the ones that she don't really relate with so this one that her boyfriends to her friends her girlfriends they had spasma so <laughs> that's that's funny it's exactly what we were expecting though is we are not surprised so thank you for watching guys please don't forget to hit the red subscribe button below and turn on your notification bell and comment your opinion on what you feel about this video guys don't forget i remain your humble jolly chuckle your musician and i'll be dropping my song soon as what do you do please hit the red subscribe button below on the comment section and turn on your notification bell and comment to pin on what you feel about this video and follow me on my social media handles at jolly chuckle don't forget guys i love you and stay tuned to my channel stay tuned guys and be the first to get notification whenever i post okay i'll be dropping my songs next don't forget love you Mwah.